Oh my goodness, good underwear, beautiful lingerie. My fa I, I could wear outside absolutely nothing special, but my underwear, my lingerie has to be the best. And he buys it most of the time, actually. <laughs> I do. So he knows what he likes. And you have a good lingerie department upstairs. Yeah. Oh, you're right. You're right. Goodness. Oh, I do not have a worst fashion memory. I mean, everything to me is an experience. So what's your worst fashion memory? Mm, do you memory? have one? Yeah, I had to, I had to buy my own uh, 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 prom suit. And it was polyester, and it was the color of watermelon. It was really bad. That but that's sounds a, bad. That's, how I, that's the first time I had to shop for myself. It freaked me out. That's why we got married, so I, he didn't have to buy any more watermelon suits. Exactly. She <laughs> saved me from watermelons. Once again, all the mistakes are the better. I love all different types of styles. Do you, do you have any? No, I love history, so it's all good there for you me, go. you know? Yeah. What is my New York City secret? Well, I think the secret in Bergdorf Goodman's is that there's somebody living in the attic. That's true, I've heard about that. A very glamorous person lives up there. Yeah. Okay. Do you have a secret in New York City? My own studio. I love my studio, it's a, and it's, a, it's private, so it's a pretty secret place. And I'm a very private person, but uh, I love my studio. Linda Fargo. Oh, there. Is there anyone else? I would oh. love to see Linda's closet. I've heard there's a lot of good secrets in there, too, as well. I'm headed there after here. 